A warm welcome to everyone from across Australia and across the world to our broadcast of this IFCPF Women's World Cup group stage clash between Australia and Japan. It's shaping up to be an incredibly exciting one between two informed teams. The Paramatildas will be full of confidence coming off a famous 12-0 victory against the Netherlands on Wednesday. And meanwhile, Japan have scored the same amount of goals over an extra game, victorious over host Spain on Wednesday, 6-1, and defeating the Netherlands 6-0 yesterday. Their number three, Mai Ota, is the danger player for Japan, scoring five of their goals so far. There have been no changes to the victorious Paramatildas starting five from Wednesday. We'll take you through that team now. So the starting five is Georgia Bykoff, six goal hero from Wednesday, Eloise Northam, goalkeeper Caitlin Smith, Talia Blanchard, who played in defence on Wednesday, and Lainey Harrison. Um, starting to string a few passes together, really, really starting to uh, to work on those on those tactics and. Well, bike off I mean, with the shot. That looked like that was cleared off the line just then by the Japanese defenders. We were so close to Australia's first goal in this game. With a drop ball, it looks like very high in the attacking half for the Paramatildas, and stabbed home. That's Eloise Northam on her left foot. And another coordinated celebration, it looks like, in the centre of the park from the Paramatildas. I'm very reliably told it was a TikTok dance on Wednesday night. It looks like they've practised another one there. Eloise Northam, the co-captain with Georgia Bykoff, has stabbed the ball home with her left foot. 1-0 to Australia. Just wanted to also continue that um taking notice of the uh, the off-field crew as we talk about Laney now. And another shot oh, off the crossbar there. Bleed from Northam and another shot through. Well saved by the Japanese goalkeeper there. Although it looks like she might be slightly injured for her efforts. We hope she's okay. And again, that was excellent build-up play by Lainey Harrison and also Georgia Bykoff. Absolutely, as we see Georgia Bykoff just trying a little bit of techers there, trying to get the ball into the box with a bit of an overhead kick. Although she's got a shot on the edge of the area and it's another goal. Georgia Bykoff with her left foot has rifled it into the bottom corner of the net to double Australia's lead and Australia's advantage and well. That certainly makes a case for continuing to put the pressure on because we have now doubled our lead, Anne. Uh, just after the Parry Matildas launched on the 7th of March, just a couple of days later, she went in for some major surgery as Lainey is on the ball. Shot, and Lainey! Lainey Harrison has scored a very well-deserved goal there. A reward for the pressure and another coordinated celebration there by the girls up front. Uh, I'm sure there are young people watching this stream right now that know what that is about, but unfortunately I do not. Lainey <laughs> Harrison, what a goal. So well deserved, Anne. Absolutely. As Japan take the free kick and cleared out for a corner. That was another fantastic save there from Caitlin Smith and then cleared away from the rebound. Danger not cleared yet. Japan will have a corner here. Will they look to go long or into the box? They've looked to go on into the box, but out for a goal kick. Looks like that was an attempt at an Olympico there. Sure. Now we Lainey Harrison again just harassing and winning the ball back there. Can she get the shot on goal? And she scores Lainey Harrison, her second goal of the game, to make it 4-0 to the Paramatildas. And that is just hard work, hard effort, hard running, just a determination to win the ball back up front, and it nets her another goal. Maddie, how good is that? And a currently 4-0 up against Japan in their second game of the tournament as Blanchard is on the ball, makes another 
Dribbling run. Harrison with another shot. And just wide again that time. That's happened a few times now where Talia Blanchard has been given license from defence, uh, has been able to have a run up the field and has found Harrison. And, and that's full time here in Salou in Spain. Australia, your Paramatildas have won four goals to nil. Goals to Eloise Northam, Georgia Bykoff, and a brace to 18-year-old Lainey Harrison.